Hello, today I'll teach you how to use the filter function. The filter function will be in the same place in almost every version of Excel. It will be in data and then you can just click filter. And as you'll see, you have tabs or drop down boxes that pop up. In the newer ones, you will have the search bar. In the older ones, you'll just have the what you can click. There's two ways to find what you want. The older ones, you can unselect all, select either keyboard, whatever you want of multiple each. Or you can just type it in and we will type in keyboard. And as you can see, once we hit enter, it will bring up all keyboard options. On the left, you will see these are blue, which means that there are other rows within these and that these are not the only rows in the Excel sheet. Now, let's say if you want to filter again, what you can do is you want everything below $1,000 total price. You could just unclick that and it'll get you the same answer. When you have a few amount of cells, that works. But when you have a lot of cells, that may be rather time consuming and you don't want to do that. So what you can do in the newer one, you can do number filters and say, let's do less than. You want everything below $1,000 and you hit OK. And it does the same exact process, but automatically. So let's say we had 75 entries. Instead of going through and unselecting the other 75, we can just say less than, and it'll give us the ones that are keyboards and less than total price of $1,000.